Double Sports Talk Worldwide with some news from the world of boxing. So y'all know what time it is. You ain't in a rush to get concussed. Let's talk a little bit of JP, heavyweight division. JP, Joseph Parker, baby. You know, uh, former WBO heavyweight champion. Got a fight coming up on the weekend versus Alex Flores, right? And, um, you know, this is one of these fights where, you know, Joseph Parker coming off two losses, one to Anthony Joshua, one to Lillian White. Uh, he has to be careful in this fight right here, right? And I said it before about a month ago, and I'm saying it again. Be careful. Don't let people dictate what your mindset is. Right. Uh, the other fights, you know, with Anthony Joshua and Dillian White could have went either way uh, if they were probably on your home soil. So if you're going in this fight thinking I have to impress, I have to knock Alex Flores out and all those things, that's when you're going to be uh, in, in trouble. You have to be careful about that. Um, look at Tyson Fury, for example. You know, this is a guy who's not going in there looking for the knockout at all, basically, in his fights. Right. He's being heralded as the man, probably the number one in the division. Right. Guy smaller than him trying to knock him out is not being heralded. So in some case, and he's bigger than everybody. He's the big old behemoth. Six, nine, two sixty pounds. Right. Can be bigger. And he's not trying to knock people out. He's surviving. You're moving. Everybody's how good it is to see a move. So all of a sudden movement is considered to be good again. Right. Which is not a bad thing. Right. And Joseph Parker, a lot of people, well, Joseph Parker has such a good chin. He's probably not been hit too many times flush because Joseph Parker is a good mover when he wants to be. It depends on the fight. Like against uh, Yui Fury, that wasn't his game plan. I'm on my front foot because he's doing that. The thing is here, you don't need to come out here trying to knock this person out no matter what. We saw that with Deontay Wilder. You we're just trying to knock somebody out instead of letting it come to you. Don't let that happen. Don't be trying to go in here and uh, just impress for some people that, you know, it doesn't matter what you do sometimes. There's people that knock people out every, t every time and nothing happens. People that still don't like them, right? So do what you do best, and that's box. Win the fight, right? If it comes impressively, it comes. Because here's the thing. Alex Flores, for him, he's been training for uh, Joseph Parker maybe two or three months. Well, three months at least, Right? This is all this is all he's been thinking about. Guy's 17 and 1. He lost to Charles Martin, 15 KOs. It means if he's they standing up and you know if he finishes the fight, <laughs> you know, somebody get knocked out. Right? So he's not in here to, you know, it's not like he fought all the great people, but he does get rid of them. So, you know, things can happen. We don't also know that Joe Parker will hit flush. He can even go down too. It's not something that he does all the time, but it can happen. And when you go out here swinging and, and trying to impress, you like, I know that Joseph Parker right now is very interested in the English market. That's where he's earned his money. And he probably wants to impress for them so he can go back there and continue to earn money. Well, winning fights get you back there as well. Right? Winning fights. And um, that's how his focus should be. If he goes in here thinking, I have to impress, it can be something, you know, something can happen here. Uh, uh, Alex Flores, Roy Jones Jr., he's under Roy Jones Jr. boxing right now. Roy Jones has seen something. And Roy Jones has seen something. So I know that more people watch Doma than do what the subscribers said. Right? I know that. So take this advice, JP, or somebody holler at him. Go in there to win the fight and you'll be fine. You go in here trying to knock somebody out, who knows what can happen, and you don't have time for that in your career right now because you're one of the best. You just have to prove that. And most of the time, the best don't dominate in every fight. They win the fights. Doing the sports talk worldwide. And I'm about to hear y'all.